Hey guys, it's Kaylin, and yes, I'm wearing the world's ugliest colored shirt right now. So, tomorrow, Monday, August 10th, 2015, I have to go back to school. But, the good news about that is that it is senior year, so, eh, last year of high school, so that's pretty good. And today I wanted to talk about, like I promised in my last video, um, the school supplies I bought for senior year, which honestly wasn't a lot. So, of course, you know, you have your backpack you've been carrying all through high school because why get a new one if this one hasn't torn up on you yet? Uh, that's thing number one. Thing number two is one of these, like, it's not, it's a binder, kind of, but it has pockets and paper. It's like three subject. So, I have a three subject one of these because I only have four classes uh, a day. And first semester, I'm only really taking three. So, that's why I got a three subject one for first semester. This is literally all I buy because... I don't like carrying a lot of stuff around and I can put every all work for every subject in one of these so that's great second I feel like these two things go together very well and you will need one no matter what grade you're going into an extra phone charger like a cheap extra phone charger that works I think I got this for like five bucks at Office Depot and and it works because I'm using one right now and a portable charger I got this for like six bucks at Walmart and besides the fact that they get really really hot when you actually charge your phone nothing wrong with it so num items number three and four for school um item number five is something that everybody needs a cheap pair of headphones I think I got these for like six bucks at Office Depot because you want a nice well, like not nice but a cheap pair of headphones for school in case a you lose them or in case b they get confiscated and you never see them again because even though teachers even though like your principal says yeah you can get them back at the end of the year you'll probably never see them again so that's why you always get some cheap ones that are sure to last you at least through the first semester and then the only other thing i carry with me every day I only carry one of each is a pen and a pencil. I literally only carry one pen and one pencil around with me until I lose them. Or, yeah, I just carry them around until I lose them. Because honestly, if I carry more than one of each, I will lose them very fast. And it's hard to find the pens and pencils I like. And they're kind of expensive. So, yep, school supplies as a senior is very bare minimum. Yep, I said that right. Bare minimum. And you're probably going to have to get stuff along the way, like a certain calculator or certain this or certain that. And some teachers are going to require you to have a binder. But, you know, even though you're going to, like, need probably some of that stuff later, you can probably go and find it, like, in your closet or wherever you keep your old school supply stuff. Like binders that aren't torn up and all that that's what I do and then I never keep up with binders anyway because they always end up really really messy and some teachers even though they say they have a weekly binder check never do so yeah that's basically it um, I don't know when my next video will be maybe maybe it'll be on time probably won't because school does start tomorrow and maybe it just depends on if anything exciting goes on at school that I can film, like if I go to the softball games or something. But it might not be until our first football game, which is the 20th, which is like two weeks from now, which isn't bad. So yeah, that is my senior school supplies. I hope you all have a good school year if you're going back, if you're not, whatever. And see you later, guys.